Well, as the snow moved in, road crews were already out there waiting and even pre-treating the road in some cases. Now comes a tough part of their job here, continuing to try and make the road safe while sharing the road with the morning rush mm -hmm. hour. It can get very, very difficult. New this morning, John Shumway has some suggestions for helping them to do their job, but also to keep you safe in the process, John. Yeah, because the last thing you want to be doing is calling your insurance agent before the day is over. So the road warriors say, Give them room to work. The salt spraying from the back of a truck meant to improve your treading can blow out a passing car's window in a heartbeat. Plus, when an impatient driver is trying to pass us or, you know, cuts, uh, cuts us off too closely like that can have a major impact on that operator um, and definitely will put the motorist in, in significant danger by doing that. So PennDOT's Ben DeVore recommends giving the trucks plenty of room, especially if they're carrying a plow. It's a 12-foot plow that's out in front of that truck. And that in itself, navigating around all the obstacles that are on the roadway that are all covered with snow, is very challenging. PennDOT's trucks will hit a particular spot every two hours, but... You know, that cycle time can go up as well. So, you know, especially in areas like Green Tree Hill where traffic does slow down, you know, if traffic is going slow, so are our folks as well. And when it's really pounding, we will have additional trucks on our high priority routes to help cover that, cut down that cycle time to keep the conditions in passable conditions. Yeah, bottom line, give them room to work. And as they've told me many times when I've ridden along with them, the best place to be is behind them so that you can take advantage of their efforts. So let's talk about the rock salt. Their spreading can blow out your windows. It absolutely can, and it does. It happened to me. I was passing a truck one time, bad idea. Ooh. One piece of salt hit a back window on my car. It sounded like an explosion when it blew out that window. So just be really careful if you choose to pass one of these trucks. Yeah, yeah that's terrifying. Yeah, it is. It would be terrifying. All right, and really good information, John, because over and over, these plow drivers have said, you know, it's hard for them. They get caught in the rush hour, too, and then they can't treat the roads. So, you know, just respect them on the roads. Absolutely. Absolutely. All right.